Hello guys, over the last few weeks I received a lot of emails and YouTube comments with the same question. Are we plotting quick admin panel version with Livewire? And we were thinking about it for a while but never really got to the point of how it would work because Livewire is usually considered for small components or small chunks of the page, but we never considered Livewire as a full version. But I tried to generate a CRUD and data table with Livewire and I want to show it to you with public repository available and now you tell me would you use this version of Livewire and should we proceed to actually build it. So currently it's a prototype, it's working already but it's not a generator, it's manual written code. Here on the screen you see the original Quick Admin Panel version of the table and I've created Livewire projects. So the same CRUD but with Livewire. As you can see, data table is a bit different because it's not using any jQuery data tables or anything, it's just Livewire. Sorting works, per page works, mass delete works. So if you want to delete selected, search works, something here. So that's one part, Livewire data table. Then in add project form, the form itself is also Livewire. So you can get the validation message like this one. And that validation happens in Livewire, not in Laravel post. So it's not posting to the server. I mean, it's posting, but it's not submitting the form. And then the edit form is also a page, a separate page, a typical Livewire URL. But inside of that, this part is a Livewire component. And I want to show you the code, the pull request in the repository, which is public. I will link that in the description of this video. What is actually inside of that Livewire CRUD? So if we scroll to the very bottom, route web, nothing changes. It's a resource controller. If we go to that resource controller here, again, nothing really changes. So it's Laravel controller without any live wire. It's loading blade. The only difference is that it doesn't have any post, store, update, or destroy method. It's all in live wire. And then in that blade, live wire project index, inside of those blades, the blade itself is Laravel blade, but inside of that there is Livewire component. So the whole page is Laravel, old version, nothing really changes, but inside of that the page content is Livewire projects index or projects form. And in this case I'm reusing for create blade, it's a projects form without parameter. And for edit form, it's projects form with the project with entry as edit form. And each CRUD for Livewire consists of two blade components, projects index, for the table, which looks like this, and projects form for editing the form, which looks something like this. In this demo, I didn't implement more complicated fields like many-to-many -many relationships, file uploads, date entries like date pickers or something like that. I just wanted to do a quick demo as a concept, as a prototype, so it will get more complicated, obviously. But just structurally, every CRUD with live wire, index, and the form. And blades, of course, for both of them, this one, resources use Livewire projects form. It's almost the same thing as in blade form, but without submitting to the actual post, it's doing the Livewire submit and wire model for the fields. And then in the table, index blade, simple table with just include of sorting stuff. That could be potentially a blade component maybe, but it's a simple HTML blade table with variables. And then the link to edit or to delete links to the Laravel, not Livewire anymore. So that's my main message to you and question. Did you envision Livewire version as we did? So Laravel routes and controllers are Laravel way and inside of Laravel blades in the pages for table and the form, there's Livewire. Also, of course, to make it work, there should be composer changes like Livewire here. Then in main admin blade, there should be Livewire styles and Livewire scripts but that's less important details. The main question to you is, would you use such version if we generate CRUDs with Livewire? Or do you have any other suggestions? What parts or what features of Livewire should we include in Quick Admin Panel Generator? So we would work on that in the beginning of 2021. So now it's time for you to help us help yourselves if you want to have Livewire Generator in 2021. We'll be waiting for your feedback. You can email me directly, pavelos at laraveldaily.com or comment on this video or comment on GitHub repository in the parts of the code that you want to comment. I will try to answer each of them and by January we will have some kind of idea where we move with that Livewire Quick Admin Panel Generator. Thanks for the feedback and see you guys in other videos.